Hello, I'm Robert Krempf. Welcome to the Experiment of the Week. Today I'm out doing some nature photography, but I went off and left my compass at home, and I need to head west. How am I going to find my direction? Well, luckily we can use the science of astronomy to find out. You normally think of astronomy at night, and if it was night, we could use the constellations to find the North Star and use that to find my direction. But even in the daytime, we can use astronomy with one very important star, the Sun. To do that, we need to look at shadows. So let's find a nice spot for shadows. This looks like a good spot. Lots of sun, nice and flat. We're going to start by taking a stick and placing it in the dirt. And then we want to mark the end of the shadow. So we'll take a rock and place it just at the end of the shadow. That's all we have to do. Now we have to wait about 15 minutes or so. So let's go kill some time. Well, it's been about 15 minutes and our shadow has moved quite a bit. It was up here where the point of the rock is. Now it's moved all the way back here. And that's all we need to tell direction. We simply draw a line from the starting point where it began to where it is now. That line is our east-west line. We know that the sun rises in the east and sets in the west, or at least it seems to. Actually, the sun sits still and the earth turns, but it appears that it rises in the east and sets in the west. That means that our shadow is going to move from west to east. Here's my east-west line. This way's west, this way's east. We draw a line perpendicular. We know this is north and this is south. Now that I know my directions, I can continue my hike. Until next time, have a wonderful week. Come here! <laughs> Come here! Ah.